You know, all other grades aspire to be as cool as you. What's going on everybody? My name is John, you're watching Soul Post, and this is another Soul Post unboxing. Today we have up for review is the Jordan 11 Low Cool Gray. The Cool Gray Jordan 11 Low is a low top interpretation of the Cool Gray Jordan 11 Regular or the mid top version, which was one of the first retro plus colorways of the Jordan 11. When Jordan brand first decided to retro shoes, they gave the new colorways of the shoes retro plus designation. So any colorway that wasn't an OG colorway got the retro plus. They had the Jordan 6 Olympic, the Jordan 11 Cool Gray, and uh, if I remember correctly, the Jordan 11 Space Jam was also considered a Retro Plus colorway, even though technically it was an OG colorway. I may be wrong on that one, don't quote me on, but I do know that the Jordan 11 Cool Gray and the uh, Olympic 6 were Retro Plus colorways. Now with the Cool Gray 11 Low, we now have the Concord 11 Low, the Bread 11 Low, and now this is the third Jordan 11 Low colorway. Of the original and first Retro colorways now, we're just missing the Columbia, and I know we have the Carolina, which is designated as Columbia, but the actual white and Columbia colorway has never been a uh, retro. There's also the Zen Gray colorway, but that was, uh, again, not really a Columbia colorway because it's got the gray panels on the bottom. And then the Space Jam colorway, which you can kind of consider the Infrared 23 colorway to be basically a Space Jam low, but that's not a true Space Jam low. Let's take a look at the box. The box is the black and gold Jumpman box with the Golden Boss logo on the top and the Golden Boss logo right there on the side. And the color code on the shoe is medium gray, white, and gun smoke. Now let's take a look at the shoe. The shoe has a gray suede upper and uh, the suede on this shoe is actually very soft. Like this is this butter suede. Like this suede is actually some pretty quality suede. I'm thoroughly impressed with the suede on this shoe. You got a patent leather mud guard as well. And uh, this is where the actual cool gray color scheme comes from, the uh, actual mud guard. Moving up the tongue, you've got the Jumpman Jordan tag right on the third row of the eye stays. Also, you've got white rope laces. On the insole is a medium gray insole with the white Jumpman. On the inside of the tongue, you've got the tag that says quality product inspired by the greatest player ever, which is the tag that comes standard with all Jordan 11s. Moving into the heel, you've got the Jumpman as well as the 23 uh, number logo. On the medial, you've got the uh, patent leather continuing right around the shoe as well as the suede. The shoe has a white phylon midsole and an icy translucent outsole with the Jumpman logo right in the center and the carbon fiber shank plate. The Cool Grade Jordan 11 is one of my favorite Jordans of all time, next to the Concord. The Concord is my favorite. Then it's the Cool Gray, then it's the Space Jam. So I had to pick one of these up just off GP. But the quality on this shoe is actually something that thoroughly impressed me. All around, like the suede, I think that the quality on this shoe is actually better than the Cool Grays from 2010. And a uh, hot take might actually rival the OG release of the uh, Jordan 11 Cool Gray. That's how good it is. Um, like the, the suede on this is actually some really good suede. And yeah, I just uh, think that anybody who wants a pair definitely should pick it up. Like there should be no doubts in your mind whether or not you should pick it up or not. Now let's get some detailed looks of the shoe and I'll catch you after the jump. Today, however, a very, very pleasant reading. 73 up in the Goodland area, 72 at Garden City, 70 reported by Dodge City and Liberal, 72 two, two over by the good folks of Garden. Southerly at about 15, with gusts of 25 miles 
an hour. Barometric pressure 30.00 and is rising. And no precipitation. We're about a half inch behind. Correction, half inch ahead for the year, and one and fifty three hundredths behind for the for the year so far. We'll be looking for a little bit of a change tomorrow, and of course the possibility of some scattered showers today. Of course, there's nothing showing up on the radar. However, the satellite photo was pretty interesting for the western half of the U.S. Rain showers and thunder showers along that frontal system. And that wide band of fairly heavy snow is now what will happen each time that you see the frontal system on there. That begins at six o'clock in the morning, and then you'll see the cloud pattern move until two o'clock this afternoon. So as of that time, of course, the front was way off in the northwest. Now, however, it's moving into the central part of the nation with a couple of high-pressure set cells behind it. Jordan 11 Low Cool Gray hits Nike retailers and Nike.com on April 28th for a retail price of $175. All right, everyone, this has been another Soul Post unboxing. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell icon so you're kept up with everything we do on the Soul Post channel. Check out soulpost.com for more news, sneaker releases, and sneaker info. Also, you can follow us on social media here. I'm John from Soul Post. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon.